All right, what happened exactly? The bar had an aquarium. All right, so we winded down Chuck's bachelor party. You know what I'm saying? This is bachelor party. So we start daring each other to swallow fish from the aquarium. You know how it is, end of the night. Yeah. No. OK. I honestly worry for your entire gender sometimes. Anyway, he grabbed the biggest one. We didn't think he was going to do it. We like, he ain't about to do it. He gulps the whole damn fish. And I guess the fish didn't like that. So the fish start fighting back, start slapping. Just start going crazy. It goes in deeper, deeper. We tried to pull it out. It would not come out. And then it kind of puffed up. That doesn't sound like a goldfish. Yeah, no, and according to this x-ray, this thing's got spikes. Mm. And then I got scared because I thought he was going to choke our puke. Or that the fish could be poisonous. I didn't even think of that. I'm going to call the bar, see what kind of fish it was. You think you have better luck just writing it down? Oh, yeah, write it down. Please don't tell Roxanne. Yeah, that's his fiance. I managed to remove all the spines. You're likely going to experience some discomfort on your throat for the next few days. And your hand is repaired, uh, but I need to have you follow up with me in a couple of weeks. Hey, so you guys, uh, you guys are smart. You're doctors, right? So how do I tell Roxanne? What, what should I tell my fiance? Maybe just tell her the truth. She might think it's hilarious. No, she definitely won't think it's hilarious. I don't know, man. She looked past that time you crashed her Volvo onto that pond. I mean, you sort of got her dad arrested. No known predators, Chuck. Hey, babe. The oh. bronze catfish has no known predators, Chuck. She knows. Would you two like a little privacy? Yeah. No known predators. That means you have worse survival instincts than any other creature on Earth. You are dumber than a turtle. You are dumber than a chicken. You are dumber than a frog. Is it going to live? It'll be fine. You may have to modify the tux to fit over the calf. No, there's not going to be any kind of tux. I just need to know that he was going to survive this so that I wouldn't feel guilty for leaving him. Whoa, babe, come on. I mean, they, they dared me. Last month, my mother offered me $10,000 to push the wedding back a year. One year. I told her no. I said it was just because she couldn't see you for who you are. But it turns out it was me. I couldn't see you for who you are because the sex is good. And because you make me laugh. And I just keep excusing your unbelievable stupidity. I keep making excuses for you. You about to leave him? Because I ate a catfish? Damn it. No. I am leaving you. Because this is not the life that I want. And when someone shows you who they are over and over, you're supposed to believe them. 